you for joining us first at seven continuing coverage on the death of John Barnett, the man who reported unsafe practices on Boeing production lines. He was found dead in Charleston over the weekend. Our Ann Emerson spoke with his lawyer and has details on his conversations with John leading up to his death and well, Robert Turkowitz tells us that he's been working on Barnett's case against Boeing since 2017 when Barnett first raised the alarm about Boeing practices. Turkowitz says he last spoke to Barnett the night before he died, and he was in good spirits. Turkowitz telling him to get a good night's sleep. They had just started a month-long deposition process. He says the case was going very well, and he told that to Barnett. Barnett told him he was looking forward to getting back to his family in Louisiana after these depositions. I mean, we're just shocked and devastated by it. John was a brave, honest man of the highest integrity, and it's a, it's a, it's a huge loss to his family and his friends, and to those who knew him. Um, you know, as I mentioned before, John never met a stranger, and he was just a, just a great individual, and he had the courage to do the right thing. And unfortunately, uh, at the end of the day, it's it's cost him the ultimate price. So does he have a target on him? I, I don't know the answer to that. Hopefully not. But, you know, I know that there are, I'm sure there were people who are angry at him blowing the whistle. More depositions with his client, with Turkwitz's client, Barnett, were planned for that Saturday morning when they woke up to the torrential rainstorm on Saturday. Turkwitz called Barnett's hotel room repeatedly at the Holiday Inn on Savannah Highway. And when Barnett didn't answer, he called the hotel and asked if his truck was still in the parking lot. That's when he was told by a hotel staff member after they checked that the hotel was calling EMS. And despite a note and a gun found at the scene, according to Charleston police, Turkwitz says he hopes that the police leave no stone left unturned in this high profile case. And he looks forward to hearing the results of their investigation. Turkwitz says Barnett's trial was for June of this year against Boeing. He says he plans to move forward with the trial and it will now possibly be in the name of the estate of John Barnett. Ann Emerson, News 4.